Okay, here we have book arrangements, three maths books, five English books, four science books, and a dictionary to be placed on a student shelf so that the books of each subject remain together. So basically, we're going to have the three maths books here. And then we could have the five English books here. Four science books here. And we've got one dictionary at the end. Now we can make three factorial arrangements with the maths books because they're all different. And we can make five factorial arrangements with the English books and four factorial with the science books and one factorial with the dictionary. We're going to multiply all of those together. And then we're actually going to think about shuffling each of these four blocks. So we're going to shuffle each of those four blocks, which is going to give me the four factorial here at the end. So I'm going to do all of that. I'm going to do all of that on my calculator. I'll do it now. now. I've got the calculator up from the previous one. So I've already got the factorial there. But if you don't know how to get the factorial, you just need to go into the option F6 probability. And there's the factorial. So we're going to do three factorial times 5 factorial times 4 factorial times 1 times another 4 factorial. So this is going to give me my big answer of 414720. So a big number. Now the next one wants the dictionary next to the maths. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have the three maths books and the one dictionary together like this. But I'm not shuffling the dictionary in amongst the maths books. So this is three factorial. But I could put the dictionary at the front or at the back. So there's two different arrangements in there. Then I've got to times it by the five English books together and the four science books together. And this time, as that one is in amongst there, I've got one, two, three blocks. So I've got the English block and the science block, but no dictionary. So I've only got three different blocks. Now you can do that one on the calculator and that comes out as 207360.